Frank here. I'm trying to figure out how to get started with ChatGPT. I don't even know how to sign in. But my gardener has an exceptional idea and needs to get a hold of Nolan Sorrento, the CEO of Innovative Online Industries, IOI, to help him with his next quest. The Sixers can help him in locating an online oasis of thugs. Back to me. I really just need to know how to get signed up with ChatGPT. Do you think there's a video for that too? Next thing I'm gonna do is show you how to set up a new ChatGPT account. So we're gonna go here. And here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to need to, because I already have a chat GPT account, I'm going to go ahead and just go here, log in as a guest, but it's going to be the same process that you're going to do. So I'm just going to go here to chat GPT. I'm going to do a search. And so here's chat GPT. So I'm going to click on that. And you'll notice that it says to log in or sign up. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to click the sign up option here. And I'm going to need to enter my email address here. So enter that in here. All right, let's do this here. Cribs, and then I'll put my Gmail, because that's the one I do know. I haven't created one, I don't think. And let's see here. And then we're going to create a password for it. So let's see. And I'll click continue. So we've logged in and then it's saying here, okay. So it sent something to my email, so it's gonna verify it. So I'm gonna go to my Gmail account here. I should be able to see that I can verify that. And so literally all that I'm doing is just creating an account. And the nice part about that is that that saves all your searches. It makes it easier. It gets to know you a little bit better as you're doing that. It verified it. And then let's see here. We should be able to continue. Okay. Time to get started. Okay. So now we're going to refresh this page. And then... Let's see, so we're going to put in our name. I'm just going to put in for date. Three. Get that to go through. And there you go. So now you've created your chat GPT account. Um, and so this is going to answer questions and it's going to do some of the work for you is the nice part about having chat GPT. So right here, this shows me any previous chats that I've done. This is where I actually type in messages. So for instance, I could ask it something like, um, what is the, I don't know if I typed, what is the best, uh, car to buy that is battery operated and let's see what it gives us now again it's going to give you an opinion on something but it's going to tell you about here's some tesla here's the chevy nissan so it's listing out all of these different things i could also go ask it other questions that i had i can get it to create an email um, you can do all sorts of things with chat GPT. And the nice part, as we go along, I'll show you some other things that you can do with it. But this is just to get you started, just to get you logged into chat GPT. That video is like part of an oasis of great ideas solving my IT problems. I now know how to sign up for ChatGPT after watching that short clip. This reminds me of a fun movie I saw called Ready Player One. It also makes me ponder if the real Easter egg is for us to acquire the right tech information to be better at technology in the real world. But shh! Don't tell my gardener.